changing his tune. Now he's saying that they stopped at a gas station and were using the bathroom at a gas station when a robber came out and pointed a gun, not at his head, but in his direction. But he told Billy Bush that the gun, it, it, the barrel was, was pressed against his forehead. Guy pulled out his gun, he cocked it, put it to my forehead, and said, get down. And I was like, I put my hands up, I was like, whatever. He took our money, he took my wallet. I knew the story was perhaps a little bit far-fetched when he said, and then the fake Brazilian cop said, do you feel lucky, punk? So do you. Um, I thought that, that sounded a little bit too familiar. Uh, well, but here's part, of, part of the reason this story starts to fall apart is because they've got uh, x-ray images of the swimmers in question going back to the Olympic Village, and they have possessions on them that they said were taken from right. them by these alleged robbers in addition to surveillance video that shows them kind of yucking it up at about the time of the alleged robbery rather than being robbed. Okay, well, we're learning this morning, just moments ago, that that cheerful mood and laughing, that was just because they were nervous. Matt Lauer spoke on the phone with Ryan Lockheed. We talked about that surveillance tape of the athletes yeah. returning to the athletes' village at 7 o'clock or so. The judge says they were joking and very casual. He says, we weren't joking. If anything, we were in shock. I just had a gun pointed at me. That had never happened before. And by the way, we, I asked him pointedly. I yeah. said, there are skeptics who think this story was concocted to hide some kind of other embarrassing yeah. behavior, something you didn't want people to know about. Were you with someone you shouldn't be with? He was adamant about that. Huh. He said, no, that didn't happen. We wouldn't make this story up. We were victims, and we're lucky and happy to be sick. Mm -hmm. well, according to the Daily Mail, that alleged incident that took place at the gas station, they have surveillance at the gas station. There's no sign of Brian Lockie. Well, and I, I don't think know. he's I honestly. Let's see if Michael Phelps will be a character witness. Okay. <laughs> if Michael Phelps says it's true, then it's true. Well, there used to be.